And I always like, since I was little, I, I think I had a vision of like at one point in my life, I'm going to have a certain, whether it's celebrity or platform to have a voice and have an impact. And at that point I thought it was it's really ironic for young women because I had such a hard time in high school that I was like, if I could just help women with their self-esteem, well, girls, I guess, before they became women, or I didn't even, I didn't know what exactly, but I was like, I'm going to have a voice. Like, and, and acting was not it. So when I got introduced to ESP, which everyone knows is Nexium, it was like, oh my goodness, maybe this is my, my tribe. Maybe these are my people. Right. So what, how did, so how did this happen? How old you're 25, 26, and you just is it on a bulletin board? Does someone, because I think, well, it's Mark. Mark yeah. kind of brought you in, right, Mark? Yeah. How did you become yeah. friends with Mark, who directed a movie, a documentary, who was, which was a big documentary called What the Bleep Do We Know, correct? Yes, and What Mar the Bleep. What the Bleep so, it's called, not What the Bleep Do We Know. Just What the Bleep. I, we just, I'd actually just call it Bleep. Just Bleep. <laughs> no, and we still bleep. So how did you meet him, and then how did this all happen? So, and I still have to get you a copy of the book, because it goes into much more detail about Scarred. this time in my life. Scarred is the book. Scarred, yeah, yeah, the book is scarred, and it, and it goes into a lot more detail than the vow, especially about this part of my life, which was, I think, you know, not very long, but it was a real quest. I'd, I'd watch with the bleep, I'd read things like The Artist's Way, um, Celestine Prophecy. It was in the beginning of my, like, spiritual journey. <laughs> I've done that, And yeah. we, we watched with the bleep, or bleep, and we loved it, and then um, my boyfriend at the time, who was a filmmaker, <laughs> got us into a film festival where he was, like, you know, uh, as a director. And I said, I'm coming with you because it was called the Spiritual Cinema Circle Festival at Sea. This doesn't <laughs> exist anymore. It's run by an amazing man named Stephen Simon who uh, directed What Dreams May Come with Robin Williams. Right. Just this really great guy. Anyway, it's a long story, but the long and short of it is the very first night they sat me down with the director of What the Bleep, like assigned seating. And... Uh, we had a conversation that uh, changed my, the trajectory of my life. And, and he told me about Nexium. And ultimately, I never Googled it. I never, you know, checked into it. I was just like, well, I like him. I like what the bleep. And he's telling me about this group of people that are working together to shift humanity. Like, this is it. I was looking for my purpose and it landed in my lap. This must be my purpose. <laughs>